What's up everybody, welcome back. Thank you so much for sharing your time with me. In this video, we are leveling up the audio of your smartphone videos with the brand new Comicop VS09 MI. Let's go. Now before we continue, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe down below. Make sure you also hit the bell so you get notified when we upload these videos on a weekly basis. And let's just dive in. Now I'm really excited to share the brand new Comica VS09. And this is a fantastic alternative for smartphone videographers in order to level up your audio. But this microphone is not only meant for video, this opens up the door for you to be able to elevate the quality of podcasts, FaceTime conversations, working from home conference calls, you name it. The Comica VS09 MI will set you back $79. And this is a fantastic prize. I feel it's on par with similar microphones in the industry. The Comica VS09 MI is a cardioid microphone. So the pickup area is directly in front of the microphone. And this is fantastic because it minimizes the background noise that could pretty much sneak in into your audio recordings, whether you're vlogging or posting on social media or just having a work meeting via your smartphone or tablet. This microphone can be easily adjusted whether you are recording yourself or you're recording something in front of you because the microphone has a 180 degree rotation, which makes it very versatile if you're using it on a gimbal, on a tripod, or just simply handheld. Another fantastic feature is audio monitoring. The Comica VS09 has a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack that allows you to plug in pretty much any 3.5 millimeter headphones for you to be able to monitor your audio. And this is fantastic because you do have the option to make adjustments on the fly if you're recording a vlog or you're just simply recording someone on a more professional fashion. Suddenly now my phone has a headphone jack so I'm able to listen to music or just simply hop in on social media and listen to the audio via those same headphones. So it's really cool. And of course, if you have higher quality headphones, even better, you can just use the 3.5 headphone jack on the Comica VS09 and leverage them for your audio monitoring. That leads to another fantastic feature and that is a built-in mute button. And at the beginning I was like, why would I want a mute button? But hear me out. Whenever you're reviewing footage, this feature has been fantastic for me to be able to concentrate on the audio of what I have just captured and not get any competition from the outside noise that the microphone is picking up. So this is a fantastic filmmaking tool whenever you're recording your short films, documentaries, or just B-roll sequences that you do in fact want to use the audio, whenever you're reviewing this audio, it's super cool to enable the mute and just simply get immersed in the audio experience of your footage. So that way you're hundred percent sure that you might or might not need to make any additional adjustments. Now, before we proceed, I took this microphone out for a quick test in different environments for you to be able to listen to the audio quality of the built-in mics on the iPhone 11 Pro Max versus the Comica VS09 MI. All right, everybody, I'm at the top of the parking structure in our apartment complex, still trying to maintain social distancing. But this is the audio being captured by the native microphones on the iPhone 11 Pro Max. And this is the audio being captured with the Comica VS09 connected directly to the lightning port on my iPhone 11 Pro Max. Now, the reason why I primarily wanted to do this test is because up here is very, very loud, the freeway is right next to me and there's a lot of wind so because the Comica BS09 has a little pop filter attached to it you should be able to pick up a little bit less of the ambient noise and a little bit less of the wind when compared to the built-in microphones and now this audio is being captured by the native microphones inside my iPhone 11 Pro Max you should be able to pick up a little bit more of a louder noise uh, when compared to the comic of es 9 and of course the wind should be a factor on this one right now. Not only I wanted to test the microphone that you're listening to right now, the Comica VS09 connected straight into the lightning port of my iPhone, 
in a loud environment such as this one with the freeway literally right in front of me and a lot of wind but I also wanted to go ahead and test the sound quality when compared to something like the Rode Video Mic Mail to see which one might be the best for this environment. I'm actually gonna go ahead and use the CAD as well. That way we can see if there's a major difference between using the CAD with the Rode or the pop filter with the Comica. See how that goes. So now you're listening to the audio picked up by the Rode Video Mic Mail with the furry cat. Let me know in the comment section down below which one do you prefer for this specific environment? Once again with the freeway and the wind. All right, everybody. So the audio that you're listening to now is coming from the built-in microphones on the iPhone 11 Pro Max. Freeways right in front of me is super crowded and windy. And this is the audio coming in from the Comica VS09 connected directly into the lightning port on my iPhone 11 Pro Max. Let me know in the comment section down below which one you prefer for this loud environment. I'm gonna be honest with you, I was surprised by the quality of this microphone, not only in the roof, which was impressive enough when you compare the built-in microphones, the wind, and just the audio levels, right? With When you have a whole environment mixing in versus being able to isolate the voice and suppress a little bit of the environmental noise that's around, but when you're in an environment such as this one, when you're a little bit more controlled, where you might have some noise, right? Some things happening in the background, but they're not too loud. I feel that the quality of the VS09 is fantastic. And with a $79 price tag, audio monitoring, mute, adjustability, little pop filter, I think this is a fantastic option for filmmakers and content creators who are looking to level up the audio quality of not only their videos, but any other extracurricular activity like social media posting, Zoom meetings, FaceTime calls, you name it. Now recently I reviewed a brand new gimbal called the Hohem iSteady X, which has blown me away by the way, but I have also been enjoying the combo of that gimbal, the Hohem iSteady X, with the brand new Comic V09 because this gimbal has an offset rear motor, it doesn't really block the port of your iPhone, so I've been able to use my Comica with this gimbal, and you can also use the Comica VS09 with other gimbals that might have a plate and it might not restrict the port of your smartphone. You do have the option once again to go handheld with this microphone straight into your phone, but if you're using any tripods or any other accessories like a selfie stick or a monopod, it also works. And the cool thing is that it's not wobbly, it actually has a really nice clicky feel when you put it in, and it gives you a little bit more security. Now having said that, I am very impressed with the audio quality of this microphone. I think it's gonna make an impact not only in filmmaking and audio recording, but also in things like podcasting, social media, and just working from home, Zoom meetings, FaceTime, things like that. You could definitely elevate the audio of whatever content you're trying to capture with the VS09 by Comica. But I wanna know what you think. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. If you have any questions or suggestions, drop them down there so we can continue to create relevant content for you. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe. And as always, thank you so much for sharing your time with me. I'll catch you on the next one.